Well, it's a Saturday. What was meant to be a family trip for a family weekend for my son's hockey tournament has turned into a boys weekend because this sickness is spreading through the house. So it's just the boy and I heading down to Indiana. Actually, we're in Indiana right now. We're in West Lafayette and we're making a quick stop for lunch and then we're heading on to Indianapolis. And when I'm on the road heading south, southeast, there's one place I love to stop. Reminds me of being a kid taking road trips down to Florida. Road trip lunch, it's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, but I'm having breakfast, sort of. But of course the boy, it's cheeseburger time. Okay, so we just got to our hotel in Indianapolis and since my son's already downstairs tearing up the lobby with his teammates, I thought I'd give you a quick uh, room tour because it's really nice. We're at the Marriott Indianapolis North, I think it's called. Um, and they said these are newly refurbished rooms. I usually feel like they tell that to everybody when you get to a hotel, but these actually seem like they might be telling the truth. I like the little uh, privacy, please. I'm watching TED Talks. Uh, I won't be watching TED Talks. Um, maybe, who knows? So here's the bathroom. And you know, a bathroom's a bathroom. Got a toity, sink. Some nice toiletries over there. I don't know, they seem fancy. You got some kind of thetan body wash. I think that's what Scientologists use. Um, probably shouldn't say that, they might come for me. There's a shower, it's got those funky square heads. Uh, flat bottom boat, goes right down to the ground. It's nice. And then, uh, let's see. Got a full length mirror here, but we got, a two, we got two queen beds. Um, it's very artsy in here. We're near a really fancy mall. This must be the fancy part of Indianapolis. I don't know. A nice TV, desk. If you were traveling for like business, this would be awesome. Like I would love to have this set up if I were here like working. Um, full length mirror. I don't want you to see me because I've been wearing a toque all day. So my hair's a mess. Oh, I'll let you see. You. I just wet it down. So it's kind of like, I don't know. I may just put the hat back on. Uh, let's see. What else to show you? TV we could get. Pandora, Hulu, Netflix, YouTube, Crackle. Um, why would you say no? Why would you say no thanks with all that stuff? A uh, little coffee maker. Is this a, I think this is a fridge, maybe? No, this is nothing. Uh, with a drawer. Ooh, what's that? A Bible, some magazines. Hmm. Ice bucket. I guess we don't have, I guess we don't have a fridge, unless I missed it, unless it's in the bathroom. But uh, anyway, so that's our room, it's nice, it's really spacious. Look at this, you can't, I don't know if you can tell, but that's a lake down there, we're right over a lake. Uh, it's sure freezing, but I don't know if it's cold enough to go for the kids to go skate on it. Uh, I think that's the pool down there, right there. So there you have it if you're coming to the north side of Indianapolis or Carmel, as we are. Oh, mate, maybe that's the pool. So I see some like deck chairs, some pool chairs in there. I lied, that's the pool. So this must be, I don't know, who knows? Who cares? Who cares, right? Uh, it's very pretty out for being, you know, a crappy winter day. So, you know what's awesome about uh, this hotel is they've actually got Tim Tracker on the TV. It's amazing. Well, ding dang. Did you get a strength shirt and a whistle? Yeah, that's the same dude that busted my shoulder that same night. I thought I found a quiet corner. So so far we're it's mid Sunday. We're we're two games in. Oh God, we've had one loss and one tie. Well, my son scored one goal last night and two today, so I couldn't be happier. And now somehow I've wound up here. That man's playing Gallagher. We all saw it. 
The sun's gearing up to play a laser tag. Hey, Sean. There he is. <laughs> Take it, Sean. That's yours. Sean loves that little skip move to the side. <laughs> he loves that move. He's a skipper. It's time for the championship game, but first, we're going to have a championship southern breakfast at Bob Evans. Look at this. It snowed here last night in Indiana, and now we're driving back to Chicago for more snow. I'm so excited about this day, but I'm more excited about some biscuits and gravy. Well, this day took a weird turn. We were sitting at breakfast, and the food came, and just as it did, my son said it didn't feel good. Ooh. I guess it's garbage day at the rink. Um, he thought he was gonna hurl. He didn't. He ran to the bathroom. He said he didn't, but his stomach hurt. Whole way here, he didn't feel good. He was carrying, holding a bag on his lap. I didn't know what was gonna happen. I was a little. I'm still a little worried, but he has since. He warmed up with the team. I just poked my head in the locker room. He's got his uniform on. Sorry, this is the this giant machinery behind this fence is what makes the ice. It's a little loud. Ice is a loud process. You didn't know that. Now you do. But he says he gave me a thumbs up, he's ready to go, so this is it. This is the championship game of this tournament, so it's it's all the marbles. We didn't think we'd get here, and we are here, and he is going to fight through. I don't push him to do that, but I'm not going to lie to you. I'm pretty proud. So let's see what happens. Well, that was a heck of a Dadder Day adventure, weekend, whatever you want to call it, hockey tournament. Um, what an ending, you know? We almost didn't go to this tournament because I was sick, my wife was sick. That's why it was just ended up being my son and I, but we literally almost canceled on Friday night. And then, as you saw yesterday, I told you that morning my son wasn't feeling good. He thought he was going to be sick to his stomach. He thought he, we thought he might have flu. We didn't know what it was, nerves, I don't know. But he pushed through, went out and played, and took the whole tournament. The whole team played great. Uh, but I mean, I couldn't be prouder. In you know, four games, he scored four goals, had multiple assists, at least five, six, something like that. Um, just, just played incredible, played his heart out. And uh, it was an amazing weekend. Uh, it's, again, I just, uh, having these trips together, just him and I, just, it means everything. I love it. And uh, so I appreciate you guys sticking around. I know it's not everybody's cup of tea, but for those of you that watch, thank you. I appreciate that. And now I'm off on another solo adventure. Where am I going? We'll see.